long way oh way oh lies too short to take too long not bad
just have to move this mic stand up a bit because I'm going to put me back out in a minute. It's the first time ever in my life I've had to make a mic stand higher. Not lower. <laughs> also, uh, in case any of you are wondering, yes, I do have two guitars, and yes, I know I'm a wanker. <laughs> Glad we cleared that up. Let's get emo. What more would you want on Saturday night than having a nice little cry about your ex? It's a new song, this is on my new record, it's called Heartbreaker. It's not actually called Heartbreaker, it's called Heartbreaker. <laughs> Hold it a little bit higher so my double chin is not so <laughs> prominent in it. It doesn't like, help, sure. It doesn't help. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> Hold your horses on edge bets, all legs in baskets. Tread lightly and slightly, you're likely to pass it. Cards close, play games long, play dumb all you like. May play a couple of fiddles before, darling. You won't play mine. You won't play mine, you won't play mine. You might play mine. And I'm no heartbreaker, I'll break my heart now for you. They say the layers better than never. I'm left guessing, are you interested or messing about? Is the intention, attention, so we circle back round To something liminal, back to fictional and predictable deceit You may have backed a few boys up, but babe, I back me I back myself, I back me You won't back me no, no heartbreaker, I'll break my heart now for ya They say the layers better than never When layers take it longer than forever I pull the other My God's been up for so long I'm tired of being on my own And I'm fed up of fighting Fed up of feeling all along For maybe darling we chance this And give it a go But I whatever pace you need I swear I'm at your speed when we go And you're no heartbreaker and you won't break my heart now, will ya? They say the layers better but I'll take never And I won't wait for you to Trevor, I'm off to get wiser and older. Thank you very much.
Last year was one of the maddest years of my life. Um, it felt like shit got very fucking real very quickly. Um, I lost a good friend uh, over Christmas and uh, holy shit man, like, it was a lot. And uh, that on top of other things, it just made the whole fucking thing a bit of a mess to be honest. But the reason I made this record and the reason I wrote this song is because things as messy as they are can sometimes be cleaned up and you can still get yourself back on track. So this song's called I'm Okay. Uh, this song is for anyone who's not feeling okay. Jesus. Not. 
I guess. <laughs> it's not alive, is it? None of the days are for anything for him. Are any of you religious? Is this really offensive? <laughs> Sorry. <Good. laughs> My nan would slap the shit out of me if she had me said all that. <coughs> She's very Irish. Right, let's get emo. And then we'll get less emo, but still very much emo at the heart of things, you know? It's <laughs> kind of how I roll. Downwards. So this song's called Spring Hill. And uh, before I play it, I suppose I kind of have to set the scene a little bit for it to make sense. Um, the day after my 18th birthday, my best pal in the world called me up and, um, and told me that his mother had uh, just died. And it was something that we knew was going to happen, and we knew was coming. But uh, it was very much something that we weren't ready for. I don't really think you can ever be ready for something like that, but at 17 and 18 years of age, you're not emotionally equipped to, uh, to deal with the loss and the grief, and particularly uh, in young males as well. And uh, the reason it was so poignant to me is because Bernie was like, um, was like a second mum. Now, I'm sure you all find this impossible to believe, but I was a bit of a gobshite when I was younger. This gentleman you see before you now, perfectly turned out with an iron t-shirt that he definitely hasn't been wearing for three days. Um, it's not always the case. But Bernie offered an alternative, and the alternative was to express myself by doing this. It was to play songs, write songs, and go on tour. And uh, I've done it ever since. So this song's called Spring Hill, and it's for my best mate Lyle, and uh, for his loving mum. Yeah. 
or two unlikely lights. But I, I seen you in months.
the bottle just like all my days I think it's not saved my life back Here's another shout out to the powers of mine People pull me back when I cross the line You keep me on a straight and narrow, that line is fine Pull the veins in every now and then To stop me driving myself around the bed
lobby there's a piss stained mattress and someone's done a shit in the shower and the lava factor 50 and I'm burned to a crispy and it's aloe vera down in Bogna Karaoke King lost all the rings as we sing on the wall Manager is fuming, boss I need a roof when you dance on the table to go Flog you some merch quick, then fuck it off into the car, drop the car off, and then come back and get pissed. Oh. If anyone's ever gonna get pissed. Yeah. If you're not, I'll just go and watch some celebrity get me out of it. It's nice to have options. It's nice to have options. I'll do a sad one. They're all fucking sad. I'll do Miller Road right now, the second. And then. Do something less sad and then I'll finish on something even less sad than the one that was prior to it yeah <laughs> I don't know why I enjoy the awkwardness I think it's because I watched The Office when I was younger <laughs> and now I'm just like, if I can get in a situation and make it fucking weird, I'll just do it. <laughs> Through a friend of a friend, she didn't know too much about it, not about indifferent ends. Rumors travel fast, and information tends to end up in the right ear of the wrong men. And I knew something I had to that a spot of awful breathing meant to want common we all in each other's pocket. It was a young man, he's that so popular with the women. So we grow, must we love fighting dandy Moving to your flat, sex attack with Zandy Quaking in the company, you know you feel alive And we two houses full, cocaine party Bounce you off the walls, loving hardly Got a fag burn in your car, keep your car's gone off the drive from the Greek honors to the tunes up on the Mayfair and the precinct Used to walk her home for parties Now she walks her baby up and down the high street Saw her briefly last week Hope to God that she knows She still is beautiful as she was When I first kissed her on the middle brook 
is all going so, so well till I found so white me. Well, I swear in the mouth. It was all wrong to my favorite protest song. No, we more than, no, we more than this. Future's anything on the past. I wanna make my moments last. You know they must be more than this. Take it on the chin off your mind. Think of the future, think of your plans. Now it's all on a piece of time.
know So he's under budget and he hits his bonus Found out he's a part-time bouncer Every other week they 15 quid an hour Come on mate, give me a break I'm skin of all bills to pay And a word if I could But I can't solve one I've seen the prices still release these days Facebook for not visiting you. So um, if you are one of those people, thank you because uh, it's fucking lovely to come down here and finally play. And uh, I appreciate it and I appreciate you giving a shit that I exist. It means a lot to me. Um, also, I just want to leave you uh, saying this on on every night on this tour, but I think it's important. Um, I'm very fortunate doing this job. You know, um, my life changed quite dramatically in the last few years. Sort of all of my dreams came true to be quite honest with you. Um, one of the best things about this job is I get to travel and I get to go to places that often I've never even heard of or never even knew existed. And it was a tour of mine that was quite um, quite uh, poignant to me, and that was when I toured with a band called The Levelers out in uh, Woo! Woo! <laughs> And uh, they took me out and uh, we went up to Scandinavia as well, and I got to meet so many different people from so many different backgrounds. and. Um, the reason I'm telling you this is not just a name drop, it is to, uh, to to confirm for you that good people still do exist in this world. I know it's fucking hard, especially with, with what's coming on, uh, what might be coming on uh, December 12th when those Tory bastards get back in. But uh, <laughs> what I think is worthwhile saying and worthwhile holding on to, and I'd like you to take away with you, as well as my new record, maybe a t-shirt, um, is that, uh, just to hold on to that little bit of hope, and you know what, maybe if we start making some differences at grassroots, we can leave this world in a slightly better place, a slightly better state than, um, than the one we found it, and we find it. Um, I wish you the best of luck. Thank you so much for coming down. I'll be hanging around, so please come say hello. Like, this has been really fucking lovely. Thank you so much. Good night and God bless.
actually done. That's it. One more. I'm in charge, Rick. Oh, you're in charge? Apparently, I'm in charge of the same management shit. Yeah, after that fucking ending and everything? Yeah. Oh, Wasted the opera early, didn't I? <laughs> um, I don't know if I can play it conscious, I don't know if I remember it. What do you got? Never Mind the gap! Show me what you got! Show me what you got! Mind the gap! Mind the gap! That's eight years long, I can't play that one. <laughs> Mind the gap! Um, Mind the gap! 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 <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> so like you're all naming songs that are definitely mine and I definitely haven't come. I don't know. Street of Origin! <laughs> this song might be clear conscience. <laughs> Is it one more? 